What is up y'all, Junior with Custom Offsets here, bringing you a brand new wheel company that's just hit the market. There's some history and explanation that needs to happen to explain how this company came to be, so let's get at it. Venom Sex is an off-road wheel lineup born from Vorsteiner. If you don't recognize the name, Vorsteiner is a luxury aftermarket company that offers wheels, carbon fiber pieces, and aero components for luxury German cars, exotics, and supercars. Sean's got a Vorsteiner spoiler on the Lambo, and in person it's incredible to see the detail and quality put into this piece, and you'd hope it's everything you want considering the price tag these pieces have. But let's get back to wheel talk. Vorsteiner wheels are all either flow forged or fully forged. Without spending three hours explaining the process, we have a separate video explaining all of that. Let's keep it quick and simple. Most wheels are cast, either gravity cast or low pressure cast. That's a molten chunk of metal poured into a mold. The next type of wheel is flow forged or rotary forged or compression forged. There's 200 names for the same process and idea. This type of wheel is a standard cast wheel but then has a barrel pulled and spun. This adds higher structural integrity to the wheels and typically makes them lighter as well. The last and most expensive type of wheel is a fully forged wheel. These take a chunk of aluminium and use lots of pressure and CNCing to cut out the wheel. Super fancy, super strong, T6061 aluminium. Vorsteiner gave their off-road lineup a lot of their high-end features from the car world. They took the flow forge technology from their luxury lineup and implemented that to all of their Venomrec styles. They also offer their wheels for specific truck, year, make, and models. There are a lot of luxury car wheel companies that will do this. RSR Forge offered this for Kirk's Mustang. You tell them you have a 2015 GT350 and they tell you, here you go, that's what you need. You don't worry about like width or backspace in your offset or anything. They just say, this is what fits, there you go. You just figure out tires, bolt them up to your car, you're good to go. Well, Venom Rex's truck wheels are basically the same thing as that, same idea. If you check out their site, you can see that they currently offer setups to fit like your Jeep, your Tundra, your Dodge, your Chevy, your Raptor, etc. They have the setup to fit on specific vehicles with no fitment issues. You can choose either 17 inch or 20 inch diameter and your vehicle and you're done. What's interesting and also very car specific is the offsets that Venom Rex offers. They offer like a negative six offset, a plus 18, and then either a plus or a minus 12. It's just funny because like in the car world you want like absolutely perfect fitment and that's like where every millimeter matters. Like that's what she said. But in the truck world, you like don't know or care about a six millimeter difference. You just know that your tires either stick out this much or they stick out this much. The six millimeters doesn't really matter. In the car scene, that's just the difference between like perfect fitment and not quite being there. Nothing wrong with it, just an interesting observation that Venomrex decided to take that concept and use it for their truck wheels. The other thing Venomrex is doing with their styles is they're very like flush fitment. So it's very OEM styling. They don't stick out a bunch. They might stick out like an inch, if that even. They're, they really go for more of like the clean, flush look with the side of your fenders, and that's basically their styling in the market they're going towards. Can you run Venom Rex wheels if you don't have a vehicle listed? The answer is yes. If you have a truck that they somehow don't have listed with the same bolt pattern that they do have offered, and the hub bore isn't an issue, you're good to run them. Confused? Don't worry. We made it easy for you on custom offsets and have them all listed just like all of our other wheels. That means you'll see them by size and offset and not by specific vehicle. So plug in your year, make, and model. Check out what Venomrex offers for you. Damn, that was a pretty smooth sales pitch. Shameless plug, I apologize. Don't buy if you don't want to, you're gonna do what you want anyways. Back to Venomrex. They've also got some pretty sick finishes. I keep seeing their VR602 in the Highland Bronze on a blacked out second gen Raptor and now like, I really want one. They also have all your typical black wheels like all truck guys want and then Venomrex also offers a tungsten graphite finish as well. My biggest complaint with these guys is they simply don't make a 10 or 12 wide yet. Rumor has it that there's some 8 lug 20x10s and 20x12s coming in the near future. The wheel that's really pushed Venomrex forward was also their first wheel offered, the VR601, offered for the first and second generation Ford Raptors. Because if you have a Lamborghini running Vorsteiner wheels, you need a set of Venomrex wheels for your Raptor, right? Right. It's definitely obvious that Venomrex isn't going after the huge lip, insane diameter wheels. They found their specific market and they're taking it over. Offering wheels designed for strength and performance, these wheels are practical and perfect for someone looking to upgrade from their stock wheels while being assured that Venomrex has done all of the math to figure out exactly what will fit, sit flush, and not run into any fitment issues. So that's all I got. Pretty sweet new company offering wheels for those of you who want to actually use your trucks and still want them to look good while they're at work. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to stay up to date with everything we're doing. YouTube.com slash TV. Peace.